Welcome back. Calls to investigate the murder of Sheila Lumumba intensified during her burial in Gem, Siaya County today. The 25-year-old was found murdered in Karatina in Nyeri County. Police have since questioned several suspects but are yet to arrest and charge anyone in connection with the murder. Here is NTV's Brian Obuya with the latest details. The body of Sheila Lumumba being carried to its final resting place in Game, kilometers away in Siaya. Lumumba's body was discovered days after going missing when her colleagues at a hospitality business noticed her absence. The family is seeking for justice. I really did her bad. I just want justice for my sister. Like the public, you can stick with us and help us to get justice. We have buried her. She's now gone. But we have to move on. See how the crime scene was. Those people were so inhuman. They. I, I don't. I don't know how people can be out there and they be able to do such a thing. It is not definitively clear what happened to Sheila. But she was found brutally murdered and might have been gang raped in Karatina at her rental apartment before the murder. She worked at a nearby resort. Now friends want the killers of their kind found and justice served. It's not an isolated case. We die every day like this and nothing is done about it. We are saying it has to end. We are saying something needs to happen and that is we are so we are hurt. We are hurt, but it doesn't have to get here so that something happens. Human rights groups are also calling on Kenyan authorities to investigate the murder that has sparked mixed reactions on social media for the past week. Members of the country's LGBTQI community who attended her burial have decried discrimination and stigma they face. The killing of the 24-year-old sparked outrage and the hashtag justice for Sheila began trending throughout last week as Sheila's family if they can help us seek for justice because uh, Leo because we saw some people were really talking bad in the internet and I'm just saying that Leo itakuwa sisi tutafanyiwa hivyo and tomorrow it will be somebody else's sister or somebody else's brother because Sheila was a human being the murder of Sheila has not been conclusively linked to her sexual orientation Kenya has strict anti-gay laws and rights groups say members of the LGBTQI community often feel unprotected by law enforcement agencies. Sheila has been buried at their home in Siaya. As police in Karatina say, investigations into who wanted her dead and why are currently underway. Brian Obuya, NTV.